Donating to charity always feels good, but it's even better when you know exactly where that money's going. Well, one organization is helping public schools all across the country to help ease the financial burdens that often falls on the teachers. We're headed inside a classroom in Brooklyn, New York, to show you how Donors Choose is making a big impact. Sometimes just a little thing makes a big difference for these kids. For Brooklyn teacher Patty Lee's pre-K class, that small thing was a loft in her classroom where the kids can escape. Sometimes they need a time where they're not bothered by anybody else and they just go upstairs and relax. And it's all thanks to an organization called DonorsChoose.org, and it's helping classrooms in public schools all over the country. The man behind the plan? Charles Best. I had the idea as a teacher in the Bronx about 10 years ago. My colleagues and I were talking about uh, books that we wanted our students to read and a field trip we wanted to take them on and an art project we wanted to do with them and we couldn't bring those ideas to life for lack of funding. That lack of funding is a problem for public schools nationwide, forcing teachers everywhere to dip into their own wallets, including Patty. My first year here I was a kindergarten teacher and I actually spent a lot of money out of my own pocket to buy materials because as much materials as they gave to the teacher, sometimes it just wasn't enough. On average, a teacher spends about $500 out of his or her own pocket every school year to provide supplies for their students that the system isn't able to cover. And I thought that there must be people out there who wanted to help improve our public schools, but wanted a way to give confidently. Donors Choose may have started small, but it exploded after a very famous endorsement. Oprah Winfrey really took our story public seven, eight years ago when we were still operating out of my classroom in the Bronx. And it was actually that story which got the ball rolling toward national expansion. And Oprah wasn't the only celebrity to lend a hand. Adam Lambert, American Idol star. One of our hardest working board members is Stephen Colbert, and he has inspired a level of generosity that blows our minds. Now public school teachers everywhere are able to submit proposals for their kids to the site. The project requests on DonorsJuice.org range from a $400 classroom library to a $600 field trip to a local museum to a set of microscopes for a science experiment to a pet hedgehog to therapeutic horseback riding for disabled students. People can search proposals on the site to find something they're passionate about and then donate as much or as little to the project that speaks to them. It's great that people can pick a classroom project to support which matches their passion and their interests, but probably the biggest thrill about giving on our site are the student thank you letters that a donor can get and the feedback that they get from the classroom showing them the impact of their generosity. I wanted to personally share with you the impact your kind and well, generous donation has had. On your me. generosity has taught Connected. them that there are people you truly the embrace the spirit of giving. Thank you again, Mrs. R. I actually jump up for joy because it's really great that people care enough to do that. And I tell the kids that we're getting new things from the classroom and they're, they wait anxiously for the boxes to come. Thomas! It is Thomas, but you gotta do that one. Read to me. Some of the materials is new to them. So for them to see something that they've never seen before, but are excited to use, that is just, it's really a great feeling. When I read through the classroom project requests on our site and I see the projects that are getting funded, it's not so much pride as it is a sense of obligation. When you see that these incredible teachers have posted project requests that capture their dedication to their students, their, their dreams for their students, it makes it so much fun to come to work. Patty's had more than 80 projects funded, including a field trip to Build-A-Bear. Many of the toys and activities you see in her classroom were all paid for by donors. Gym equipment such as balls and balance beams and the fish tank which gives them a pet and they love looking at it. The puppet stage where they're putting on shows. Which keeps the kids looking forward to school each and every day. It makes it a lot easier for them to learn next year and instead of playing catch up, they're ahead and ready to learn. Aren't those kids cute? I love that story. Well, if you're a public school teacher or if you know one and want to submit a proposal for a project, just go to DonorsChoose.org or you can also go there if you'd just like to donate to a project.